The Kanu National Chairman, Gideon Moy, has asked the government to reconsider its earlier resolution to reject fresh recommendations in the energy bill, which seeks to have a county as a hosting natural resources that benefit the most. Speaking at a Tiati in Baringo County, Senator Moy said communities in mineral rich areas are set to benefit from the new bill that imposes a strict requirements on mineral operators while giving locals a greater say over their resources. Speaking at the same venue for court community spokesman, Professor John Lanyangapur said Kano will have candidates battling for elective seats apart from that of president. Niko Muswada ambaye mefika, ambaye tulisema na tukapitisha National Assembly, na tukapitisha huko kwa Senate, na tukasema mali wa pesa ambaye tapatikana kutoka mafuta na hata hii geothermal yote, 30%, 30% itaka kwa county. Na kwa hiyo 30%, 20% itaenda county, na 10% itaka kwa community. Juzi, sirikali merudisha. Sirikali karudisha yu mswada na kusema la. Wamekata kwamba shirini yende county na tanu peke ikai kwa. Sasa njina kubali yu maneno? Oyoni? Ndiyo hiyo ata mi mnye ni naasema kwa rais to reconsider his position. And the government reconsidered their position. 30% tulipitisha sisi zote. Na tulijua kwa sababu gani tulipitisha. Ile maendeleo ambayo inatakana hapa ni mingi. It's huge to open up this area. Tunataka tuchukue watu wetu kutoka pale wako sasa wakae kama wa Kenya wengine. Kuna fitina inarushwa na kutembezwa hapa. Kwanza tiati. Ati kanu hakuna kichwa. Kichwa kani na mimi ninasoma kitu cha Republic of Kenya. President ni moja one at a time. President ya wajaluo ni nani mkuri yu? Semeni uhuru Kenya hata ama kwani walichagua gani? Walipochakuwa moja anatokesea ama seneta wenu ni nani si kuna wengine walisimama na yeye whether you like it or not yeye ni nini yes na mimi pia simunipikie makofi west pokot seneta nilisimama na mheshimiwa poisho yuko hapa ananiita seneta wake hana spare hana kiburi ya kudanganya especially west pokot wa pokot hapa ati hakuna kichwa na wenye wanatangaza hii kwa volume ni wale watu waliua nyumba yao watu wa URP na mdomo mrefu na kubwa ifuatwa na TNA bado wanakumbuka nyumba yenye ilichomeka sasa muzituambie choice ni moja vile biblia vile katiba inasema Kenya is a multi party democracy